Hello friends, this is the schematic of our MSP430 motor controller board. Uh, this motor controller board or shield as you can call it is designed to be plugged on top of the MSP430 launchpad development board. This board to be precise. Now the MSP430 launchpad has 20 pin connectors. So our board will also have 20 pin connectors. Now we have two ICs here. One is the L293D motor controller chip, this one. And the other one is the ULN2003A high current driver section. Uh, the board provides the ability to control two DC brush motors using L293D here. And a stepper motor or a high current load here. Now I'll go to the motor controller section here. We have two connectors, J5 and J6, which can be used for controlling the DC fresh motors we have the voltage select pin jp1 through which we can select the plus 5 volt or plus 12 volt motor so the so we can use both the 12 and 5 volt motor which is useful for building small robots and other things these are commonly available uh, voltage ranges for the motors so the other one is the high current current high current driver section using ULN 2003. Now here also we can select the voltage. So if you select it towards 1, the voltage will be plus 5 volt and it will be used to drive the load, a plus 5 volt load. For example, a relay or a plus 5 volt stepper motor. Same thing here also. We have a 12 volt uh, supply here, which can also be used to drive 12 volt relay or a stepper motor. And all these pins of the ULN 2003 are provided uh, in the form of a screw terminal or a terminal block connector. Now since the board, the MSP430 launch pad board does not provide any plus 5 volt system, we are taking the 5 volt from outside the board. So we have a barrel jack connector to which you can plug a 12 volt adapter and the voltage is converted to plus, volt, plus 5 volt here and plus 3.3 volt which is used for powering the MSP430. We also have a short key diode here. So this is the schematic. Now I will show you the PCB. This is our PCB. It's a two-sided board. We are going to send it for manufacturing today and then we will see whether this thing will work or not. Uh, this is the improvement of an earlier one. This was the early one. Let me show you this one. This was the old one. Uh, it only had a single L293D and an RS485 chip. So now we have replaced the RS485 with a ULN2003. The board is also larger compared to this one. Now I will show you the 3D view. Now if you have any suggestions or you have any doubts regarding this board, uh, you can put it in the comment section. I will try to answer it. Now this is 3D board. Uh, here we will have the terminal block connectors for the ULN2003 and here we will have the motor controller terminal blocks we have to provide the power supply through here now I am using a SMD ULN2003 chip here right here the chip ULN2003 chip will be here right here these are the power supply ICs and this board is made in India. If you like this board, you can buy it from our website or you can put a comment section. Now, after getting this board, I will be making some videos regarding the how to use the MSP430 microcontroller using Launchpad development board and how to control this motor and other stuff. If you are interested, you can subscribe to our channel. So, 
that's it i'll be sending this for manufacturing so if you like our video do like it and subscribe thank you